Hey MechWare, welcome back to Opal Plays MechWare 5. We're in Manadorf, where we just finished off Crimson Crusade Episode 2, and still haven't even repaired our mechs. Now this guy's still showing he needs to be repaired, and the cockpit took a hit. And that's kind of weird, because the cockpit doesn't... Oh, I got this. I thought I clicked on that. Wait a minute. I did repair all. Put a laser in. I guess I didn't. Obviously I didn't. Another four days out here means... Well, ten. And... The Phoenix Hawk is needed for mission four. Everybody else still needs repair. And we still gotta travel, so... Not that big a deal. We'll, uh... Take part three, and notice that each one of these is 2,500 um, reputation points, so they go greatly towards getting us up to the next level. Ardas. I'm running this campaign as slim and lean as I can, and as you can see, that's pretty lean for me at this point. Um, just pushing it. 70 campaign, 315 ton. And I'm going to bring, you know, 315 or thereabouts, but I'm going to stay in my uh, ON 1 protector because I'm better in that mech. And I think what I'm going to take out for sure is the Centurion. And she has a 9 for energy, so we'll put the uh, the J down there. I might even switch these two out because the J is better than the Warhammer, I think. 55. Nope, it's not. What do you know? But maybe I need to put Prescott up here. I think so. Let's move her to slot two. Wicked, Wicked. And give her the battle master. Nobody has any negatives. Um, 20 tons under. We're going to push it. I gotta change something here. It kills me that my medium lasers are on four and I almost never push four. It's my alt key on my left hand. So. Our compound. I am High Lord Franson. Turn back now. You have no oh, yeah. right to be entering this airspace. The VTOL is playing hard to get in. Seems they know we're coming. We'll proceed as plans, Commander. But be careful down there. As they say, nothing is as dangerous as a wounded beast backed into a corner. High Lord Franson. For someone looking to tear down the social order, he certainly thinks highly of himself. Though I suppose you'd have a big ego too if you had a custom dragon to call your own. Our intel from the governing body tells us he's acquired one through his army of followers. Looks hmm. like we're at the wrong place, Commander. Our target must have given us... Nope, can't fire my gauss. I'm going to turn to, sorry. Reporting. It's gone. 
Cranston will be here soon. Get up over the hill. Come on. There you go. That tree will deflect the shot, so. Here it comes. Just in time for a dropship behind us, of course. You loosen up that nut. not to get shot in the back on the way to the dropship. Yep, that's nice. It's a catapult. that gesture's AMS when you need it. Of course the answer is on the gesture. Ideally wicked you would pick your own targets. Uh, right, right next to a turret. That's always handy. <laughs> Stuff happens. Let's get out of here. We didn't get beat up too bad. In fact, for 20 tons underweight, we didn't get beat up at all. We could got a little bit. Or a little bit got wicked. I got AMS. Do I have ammo? Say yes. There we go. And that's the mask that the uh, dragon was using, probably. But. We should still also get the dragon in good shape. Well, beat up like hell, but uh, hey, look at that Warhammer. Moffat's knowing what he's doing. Good job. Didn't lose any bits or pieces on the Battlemaster either. And that's a lot of damage. So she was putting it out and soaking it up, as you can see. Good deal. Your transmissions. We don't get the actual dragon until the next one so you can't take a look at it yet you got to stick around watch that one and uh, don't forget to comment like subscribe I very rarely say that in the middle or at the beginning so now I know I got you and you heard that comment like subscribe set the YouTube algorithms pointing people and pointing yourself my way and I'll be here showing you the best I can how to play this game and have fun at the same time so I don't have a view transmission. Did I already get it? No. Yes, it's up here. Let me go ahead and repair all. He's still on the way on the mend. Hmm. Eight million C bills. That's a low amount of money for me at this point, usually.
this one, as I said earlier, is a 50 ton limit. That's why I made the uh, Phoenix Hawk. Now the Phoenix Hawk Cobalt, I think, is, is the absolute best you're going to get for this mission. It's a hero mech. It runs at 116. It's got jump jets. It, as I configured it, it's got uh, ECM, so... And put sensors on it, I think. No, there weren't no sensors available where I was. So let's see if there are some here. Still none. Now that's negative. But what I'm going to do is find sensors on somebody else and take them out and do the build for it. No sensors here. Uh, I think for sure he's got some. Yep, I will take those out. Four days, start to work. Ten days, bummer. And wait the ten days, because it matters. It absolutely matters. Should have done this on the way to here. Ow. Had to make a payment for that. Yeah. Okay. And... Go back in, go to him. Add those sensors in. Maybe even an LMS. No. No, I have to do a ton and a half for the LMS. AMS. So. That's plus 100 yards. It could matter. 12 days. Wow, 10 days to take them out, 12 days to put them in. I guess it costs more not to drop them on the ground. Let's, uh... Let's do it. Don't see... It will not be a salvage mission, so... I think Rita doesn't like me anyway. Is under a heavy weather warning. It's going to affect visibility for you. This is a me, me, me mission, I think. It might be a wicked mission. Who's got the experience? Gold. It's a wicked mission. Nothing for it. Now, if you were clever, you noticed I went over to the left-hand side, off-screen, stopped the recording, paused, saved it, and came back. This mission's tricky. In fact, last time I did it, during a uh, playthrough, I got killed the first time and then had to go back in and win it. Incoming message from our contact in the 6th Arkad Legion. Commander, Brigadier General Rozowski here. I wish we were meeting under better circumstances, but time is of the essence. I'll be brief. The few remaining Crimson Inclination members... He's not brief. ...meet with House Steiner operatives about a possible arms deal. Naturally, this is a problem for House Curita, but the Brass Fila show of force would only tip off the Inclination's foreign handlers. This, we hope, is where you come in. We want you to run an interception role for our small strike force. Drawing the inclinations back into an ambush at a nearby ravine. The boggy terrain should make mobility difficult for them, trapping them, and allowing my forces to move in and put an end to this once and for all. I've already supplied your CO with the location. I know we're asking a lot from you. Stop Rest talking. Assured, you will be handsomely compensated. Razuski out. So we're the bait. There's a smart way to go about this, Commander. Stealth is key to success. I have readings for a number of detection installations around that you should disable before they alert the inclination to your presence. Rozerski was right about the terrain slowing mechs down. Use jump jets to dislodge from the swamp. It should make navigating through it easier. You're approaching a comm station now, Commander. Take it down. Little bit toasty. 
think I left a turn back there to can't no, yep, he can't follow me anyway. Oh, and a tank, okay. Swing This is much hotter. Normally I change out an engine, get it down to about uh, 97. And take the difference in heat management, but... This is not something you, have to, you should fight anyway. Except for the turrets and tanks that are here. Damn, reddened up my back already, or orange. Could be a special mission. I don't feel bad about doing these over. Not a uh, light mech uh, pilot. I'm tired of those guys shooting at me. Now I just gotta face down five mechs. Including, once again, that dragon sidewinder I just got through killing in the last episode. It is inexplicably still here, on a different system, repaired. It's like, what agility. I am an old man. One. Two. I wish they were all this easy. This one's fast enough to actually hurt me. If you stop and fight and shoot off a leg, it's a bad thing. Three, four, five. Yeah, right. One bridge. Dodge, dodge. Hard turn. They blew the bridge up. Didn't matter. New target, dragon. That's my buddy with the AC-20. He takes you out one shot. All Up for it, cross the kill zone. Yep. Done. They just wait. Every once in a while I get cocky and I'll go in there and shoot them, but... All you're doing is taking more damage. If these guys can't do it, you ain't helping. And this is not about salvage. Well, except for that dragon, which you get automatically.
This should be your first view of the Marauder 4As. There are several of them here, and those are the 100 ton Marauders. And PPX is in this version, because DLC 6 is very active. There. I did damage to one. Well, the Dragon Sidewinder. Well, three pecs don't get much, but I'll take that. And I think it's time to upgrade some of these, so... Yeah, at this point in the game, medium lasers are still the thing. The best, so... Not bad. 14 kills. And a Dragon Sidewinder that is... Mostly intact. I say mostly because the XL engine is still there. And that's all I want out of it. We'll claim that, and I gotta head down to... We'll try the closer one, Meacham. Yeah, that's far enough. Hmm. Oh, a million sea bills. I gotta look at mechs first. Yeah, another Orion? No. Oh, I'm really chewing on fingernails about that. No rares, no heroes, so... All of my battle mechs need to be repaired except this one. So I put him over here. And... No, all of them's a one. this one. I don't like putting mechs into my cold storage for long term, unless I've actually repaired them. So, this will actually be ready when the time comes. <coughs> this one, I'm selling. This little guy, He's a hero mech. I don't sell hero mechs. That doesn't prevent me from stripping them. Especially of that and that. Repair that. Drop it. Drop it. <coughs> I'll take the mask. This is one of my exceptions to put it over into the uh, cold storage unrepaired. <coughs> Excuse me. And if you've played through the campaign before, you know that the next mission is lock and load. And it is over in here and you haven't even gotten over there yet. So I'm going to go ahead and go to kill and fold and let the... <coughs> Excuse me. Throat got dry all of a sudden. Let the stripping of the Dragon Sidewinder happen. Hope for better mechs. Yeah, I got a Stalker, which is, a, you know, and it's affordable. So that's an affordable um, assault mech. And I think I'm going to go ahead and take it. These guys can lay down some serious damage, so 
and absorb it. Now I gotta fix it. So for me, it's Dragon Sidewinder being done. I'm gonna go to the Phoenix, to the uh, Protector. I got, yeah, I'm only 25 minutes in. And the first thing I'm gonna do is slap in the Excel engine. Now I got 10 extra tons to play with. And one of the things I'm definitely going to do, those go away, that comes down. Wow. Large lasers are in really short supply. Still. I'm going to shoot it in, because why not? You know what? That's a better place. That can come out. Uh, gonna be that one. Not a whole big change, but Gauss rifle. Yeah, the problem is that the uh, the O one one P gets a plus for P for PPC, including this one. That's thirty four points of damage here. Watch this. Put it back over. Look it back up. It's 27. 34. Same thing for Gauss. If I get a, a better Gauss, it goes in for sure. But right now I don't have it. I'm at 4 for 2. And 5 more tons. I really want to put another large laser on that, but instead what I'm going to do is uh, eliminate the cost of that. And I need a little bit more heat sinking. And see if I can pick up better sensors. I'll take three of those and put in one. And really about the only thing I can do is, is cool it off some more right here. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. ECM's always good, if it's actually effective. I, I really don't know. The only way to, to, to know is to, you know, be inside the mech and, and see what the, you know, how much it shakes up the, gosh turn it. Give me a half, give me a half, give me a half, half. Thank you much. I don't do pirate unless I have to. I mean, that's a good get for pirate, but so, fix this guy up a little bit. And once again, I'm coming up on broke. So, I've got two assault backs, and I keep saying, yeah, they're good assault backs, but I won't fly them. What's up with that? You get up here. You get up here. That's a lot of single heat sinks. So one ton each for the sixes and one ton. Where's my one ton for the? Aha! Uh -huh. It is not there. And that's a pretty fair loadout actually for a uh, AI mech. We'll just go ahead and do a repair all. And throw in a sensor. I 
Just checking it out. Yeah, that's 80. And that's all tier 1 shit, so... That's not a bad mech. And unless you're shooting at it, because then it's got that big ass head, so you can just crank out that center cockpit, uh, center torso real easy on these. So it was 300 tons out of three, or 295 with my previous, and if I throw out the Warhammer and bring in the Stalker, we're getting there. I think we're ready for the next mission. Unfortunately, it's 31 minutes into this. So we're going to wait until the next episode for seeing if we are in fact ready. It's a 700 ton, which I equate out to about 315 ton. And we're right about there right now. So I'm really wanting to take that. I'm really wanting to take that. That's a nice big long one though, so... No, I'm going to have to wait till the next episode, folks. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Come back next time. We'll see you then. Opa has left the building.